I forgot to do it last night. Uh, one airhead. Well, at least it makes me feel a little better about myself. Damn me! Damn me! Alrighty, sup everyone, this is Blue X here, and welcome back to Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. So, we already asked Yuri what for our poems progress are made. We never asked Sayori, let's go ask her. Her blank imp impression is kind of. <laughs> it was like, what? <laughs> anyway. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hey, 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 hey. Don't quote a s s don't don't you dare fucking quote a certain YouTuber I should not name. He's a fucking Sony pony. Anyways. This is so good, Blue X. Really? You thought my poem was good? I don't know what to feel about that. Eh? I love it! <laughs> yeah, I have a feeling she might be a... have an airheaded personality. I, I can easily tell. I have no idea they were... you were such a good writer. Oh my god, why did I give her a fucking bimbo voice? Blonde valley girl voice? Like, what the hell is wrong with me? Sayori, you might be seriously overreacting. I'm not a good writer at all. Yeah, no shit me. No shit me. I suck at cursive, okay? I know I already mentioned this in my previous Doki Doki Literature Club Plus video. It's like two days ago, but I don't give a shit. I suck at cursive. And I need to be punished! Anyway. I honestly have no idea what I'm doing. Well... Maybe that's why... Why what? What, what? what? Elaborate woman. Because I have no idea what, what I like either. Yeah, something tells me she's not that bright, is she? <laughs> yeah, don't quit your day job. Jeez. Yuri's opinion was way more cons constructive than this. I mean, at least with Yuri, at least she gave a quite inside feedback. Wish, cause, wish I could say the same with Sayori, though. Maybe even Noski's. But we haven't even asked Noski yet. Boy, we haven't asked her yet. Are you sure you don't like it cause, just because I wrote it? Oh, wait, that's me. That's me talking. <clears throat> Are you sure you don't like it just because I wrote it? Eh? Well, I'm sure that's part of it. I think I understand you better than than a lot of people, you know. You know? So, when I read your poem, it's not just a poem. It's a Blue X poem! Again, don't quit your day job. And that what, and that makes it feel extra special. Like I can feel your feelings in it, but oh my god, what is wrong with me? I made it so cringy. It's not even funny. Sayori hugs the sheet against her chest. Okay, you don't need to get so rough. 
with my poem, please. You're so weird, Sayori. Damn me! Damn me! I know she's not that bright, but calm, calm your tits. <laughs> I'm really happy just that you wrote one. It just remind me of how you're really a part of a club now. Not to mention the fact I'm standing in front of you in the classroom. Just clearly this is not awkward at all. Eh, well, of course. I'm not really into it yet, but I, that doesn't mean I'll break my promise. See? It's like I said before, Blue X. Deep down, you're not selfish at all, you know? Selfish? Where did you came up with that assumption? Trying new things like this for other people, that's something that only really good people do? Oh, you sweet summer child. Thanks, Sayori? I'm not sure if Sayori sees the full picture of my motive here. Trust me, I know how you feel me. I know how you feel me. I I she's way too optimistic for her own good. Or maybe she's just really depressed. She's just trying to hide her depression by being optimistic all the time. If my theory was correct, if my theory was correct, then oh dang, I felt bad. Then again, I can't deny that she's part of the reason I joined. Uh, she is the main reason why we joined, unfortunately, despite me being suck at cursive. Knowing how much this means for her, to her and all. Yeah! Oh my gosh, shut up. And I'm gonna make sure you have lots of fun here, okay? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. That is so stupid. Anyway, that will be my way of thanking you. Alright, I'm going to hold you to that then. Yay! Gosh, shut the fuck up. Now, you you read my poem too, right? Don't worry, I'm really bad at this. Okay, I don't know why I'm even ask her her opinion about my poem. Hehe. <laughs> we'll see about that. Dear sunshine, the way you glow through my blinds, blinds in the morning. It makes, fe makes me feel like you miss me. Kissing my forehead to make help me out of bed. What? Making me rub the sleepy foam from my eyes. Are you asking me to come out and play? Are you trusting me to wish away a rainy day? I look above, the sky is blue. It's a secret, but I trust you too. But it wasn't for you, I could sleep forever, but I'm not mad. I mean, at least I can read it at the very least. At least it's not cursive, so that's why I was able to read this. Anyway. Sayori. This is just a guess, but... Did you wait until this morning to write this? Is it really that obvious? You know, fun fact, I used to do that sometimes. But not not until morning, not until I get to the bus. Hopefully I could finish it real quickly. Trust me, it happened in middle school. Well, actually, it happened in elementary. I can't remember. It's like between those two lines. Anyway. No! Just... just a little bit? You can't answer just a little bit to a yes or no question. 
I forgot to do it last night. Uh, one airhead. Well, at least it makes me feel a little better about myself. Damn me! Damn me! You, you hold no punches, me. You don't be mean. I try my best. I still try my best. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. I didn't mean to say it like it was a bad poem. It just, it came out nice. Or should I, should I, I, how should I put it? It sounds just like you. Really? Yeah. Especially the last line. I made eggs and toast. Okay, um, while we talk about food. Even though you were late to school, it's bad to skip breakfast. I'll get all cranky. Well, I guess there's no point of ar in arguing. Anyway, thanks for showing me. He. <laughs> this was so much fun. Monica's the best. Oh, we'll get to that. Get to her eventually. Uh, yeah. But next time, I won't forget. And I'm gonna write the best poem ever. Well, I guess I look forward to it. Okay, that's it for Sayori. There's two girls left. Natsuki, oh my god. And Monica. You know what, I'm gonna be saving Monica for last. But as of right now, I'm gonna save this game. And that will be enough for today. If you enjoyed this video, if you do, give a like. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. Follow me on social media and hit the notification bells for my future videos. I might as well have to schedule my next Doki, Doki Literature Club video for tomorrow morning. Because I have a special, special surprise horror game coming real soon. Besides my upcoming Let's Play of Until Dawn. I'm not telling. It's gonna be a surprise. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, give a like. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. Follow me on social media and hit the notification bells for my future videos. Alright, I guess that'll be all. Take care, I guess.